Dear friends, welcome back to Automate with Rakesh. Let's go through some of the questions around the CV check property. Now let's see the very first question. This question we have already seen in my previous video where I've explained practically. However, I will just read this and see the answer. In a desktop application using computer vision, there is a requirement to ensure the enable additional icon checkbox is selected. Here is that at the start of each execution. If the checkbox is unchecked, the workflow needs to check it. But if it is already checked, no action should be taken. Which option should the developer configure in the CV check activities action property for this scenario? Now this one I have practically shown which should be the right answer, but you must be knowing it. So go ahead and comment the right answer for question one. What is your answer? Pause it and comment your answer. Let me reveal the right answer is A, check. Let me move on to question number two. In UiPath computer vision, when using the CV activities, what does the cursor motion type property control? Cursor motion type. And why might the smooth option be preferable for the certain elements? Okay, why the smooth, why should you go for smooth option? Option A, it determines the speed of mouse movement. B, it specifies the cursor appearance and smooth is suitable for improving visibility. Are you doing it for visibility? Option C, the smooth option is suitable for elements that respond to interaction only when the mouse smoothly enters this area. Option D, it manages the duration of mouse clicks and smooth is recommended for situation involving multiple clicks. Are you going to use it for multiple clicks? Now pause the video, select your right answer. Let me reveal the right answer for this is option number C. This smooth option is suitable for elements that respond to interaction only when the mouse smoothly enters their area. Now here I am on the CV check documentation. Now if I scroll down here under the cursor motion type, if you see this option is suitable for elements that respond to interaction only when mouth, mouse smoothly enters the area. Okay, so this is the right answer. So I'm going to highlight. So now you can justify why C is the right answer. Thank you guys for watching. Please do keep commenting the answers to the questions, even though you're going wrong or right, doesn't matter. Keep interacting with my contents by commenting on them. Thank you guys. Let's move on to our next question.